All right, I uh, think we are ready. Hey guys, good morning. How's it going? You guys excited for some more Resident Evil? It's surprising to see people already hanging out in the room. That's really cool. Okay. Anyways, you guys excited for some more? Oh Resident God! Oh, that's gonna go forever, isn't it? Shit. Oh well. So we are gonna finish. Um, the uh, Chris playthrough of Resident Evil. Um, and based on the amount of time that's probably going to take, after that, I think we will end up doing, uh, or starting Jill. Because uh, I didn't want to start Jill. I thought that would be a lot of fun for everybody. Because um, I definitely, like, like, I don't want to put the game down. And for a game that's over 20 years old, uh, that's saying a lot. Um like, I didn't want to put it down the other day when I had to finish the stream, but I had, you know, adulting to do. Hmm. Look at this cool old Capcom logo. I haven't seen that in ever. <laughs> Actually. Alright, so here we are back in the horrifying world of President Weevil. Uh... <laughs> Oh, I thought I heard something weird. Anyways, okay, so we had just finished up the guardhouse. Um, we had used... What is it? An absolute ass load of... Oh, man, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> look at that old model. That's crazy. Everything clipping into itself and everything. Um, and I'm not exactly sure what we were trying to do next. Uh, but we have the helmet key, so we're going to be going back to the mansion. Like, that's, you know, plain to see. Uh, let's see, green herbs, lighter, tons of green herbs. Okay, are those all the shells I have? Um, at this point in the game, it's kind of pointless to keep the pistol on you, uh, if I remember correctly. Because uh, shit's about to get real bad. Um, so shotgun, and then we'll be picking up our next most powerful weapon, uh, shortly, I think, actually. Let's see, so hopefully... I'm gonna grab one of these, just in case. I know we have more coming up. Uh, but we will be passing by a... Whew, can't speak today. Um, I know we have more coming up, but we will be passing by a box where I'll be able to drop those blue herbs off. What was that? Uh, radio. Did you guys hear the radio go off? Ah, delicious. Chris. We got a call Brad, from the Brad. Can you hear me? Damn. Um, so I was talking to people in the chat... Uh, the last time we streamed this, and everybody seems to have um, uh, been telling me that I had royally fucked up. Um, I had royally fucked up by um, allowing uh, what's his name to die. Uh, God, I can't remember his name. The guy that gets Richard. Richard. Uh, he got eaten by the snake. We never saw him alive, uh, and people were saying that I'd screwed up, like the quote unquote. Do I need the thing? No, I don't need the thing yet. Okay. Uh, people seem to have been implying to me that I had screwed up the good ending um, by allowing Richard to die. Uh, I found out recently uh, by doing some digging on the wiki that that is not, in fact, the case, um, uh, which is great. Um, there's, there's a bunch of different little things that you can do and that can happen. Um, as each character that changes the way the end of the game plays out and uh, what characters actually survive with you. Um, excuse me. And what I had found out uh, is basically uh, the fact that I ran into Rebecca at Plant 42 and she was able to do the V-Jolt actually meant that um, she's going to be safe until the end of the game. Um, I checked, I had checked two different sources to make sure that that was the case, and although I couldn't find, like, a concrete source, that seemed to actually be the case. So, hopefully Rebecca should be good to the end of the game, and as far as I know, 
Um, weird, no strange transition here. As far as I know, um, we don't have any control over uh, finding Jill or anybody else towards the end of the game either. Wow, nothing's... Oh, shit! Oh, here it comes! Oh, this is what... It... Oh, oh! <laughs> I'm terrified. Actually, uh... This is where the game gets crazy. Uh, because now we get hunters. Um, and these things can insta-kill you. No, I don't... Why was I running straight ahead at it? Son of a fucking... You've used the mansion key. All right. We're going to have to deal with that in a second here, but jumping in and out should be good enough. Ooh. Let's see. Do I need a lighter in here? There's a switch. Will you push it? Yes, I shall. Oh, never mind. I guess I don't. Did I take any damage? I'm in yellow fine, but that should be that should be okay. Uh, I can only see moonlight and dense forest. All right. Oh, here's what we came here for. The Doom Book. Um, the first time I played through this game, I'd forgot about the checking mechanic. And so when it came to these Doom books, I fucked up and I never did this. And so I was right... Oh, sorry, guys. I was right at the transition to the mansion, and I couldn't find these fucking medals. <laughs> A medal from the first Doom book. And... You can all call me an idiot in the chat. Uh, you'd, you'd be fucking right. Let's see, is there something over here? Is there a note? No, there's magnum ammunition. So fuck it. Uh, this is where we start to get the magnum. And uh, as you guys can imagine, the magnum is an overpowered beast weapon. Eh. And we're going to be saving that for that and the shotgun for the latter half of the game. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. No, let me in the door. I bet I took damage there again. Like, yellow caution damage. I, I know there's one here. we got to wait for you to get up. Come on. Is that enough? No. Took six six rounds. That's uh, unfortunate. Uh, but luckily there aren't as ooh there was a note there. Luckily there aren't as many uh, hunters as there are like zombies and whatnot later. Hmm. Ah, so we'll get to the note later. But the note says I left a bunch of uh, uh, stuff in this room for you to take. Um, specifically there's magnum ammo, or not magnum, there's shotgun ammo, pistol, pistol ammunition, there we go, um, and a first aid spray, uh, all of which will be very useful very soon. Uh, not so much the pistol, although we will run into one more point later in the game where the pistol will be useful. Um... Once you get to the mansion, if I remember correctly, the way the mansion plays is it kind of plays like a like a lightning round of how the rest of the game played. Um, and what I mean by that is... See, we don't need to save or anything yet. What I mean by that is that when you get to this last point here... I'll put... I put I'll put some bullets in the back room, use them in case of trouble, Wesker. Oh, it's not a pick up a bull item. Okay, that's fine. Um, um, and so once you get to the once you get to the lab, I don't know if I said mansion or lab. The lab plays like a lightning round of the rest of the game, where you run into a ton of zombies and then a ton of others. That always that color. Yeah, it had to have been. Let's see. Can I just? Come on, get up. Yeah. Wow, no! No! <laughs> That's why they give you fucking shotgun ammo here. Am I in yellow caution yet? Yes, I am. Damn. Well, I've got green herbs in all the rooms, so... Oh. I've got a ton of green herbs sitting in those damn... 
Nothing in here? Okay, cool. Uh, a ton of green herbs sitting in the words I can't think of. Uh, item box. There we go. Why couldn't I think of item box? Damn me. Anything bad in here? Oh, no. No, 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 no. We're not going in here yet. We'll do the rest. <laughs> oh, that's a bad room. Um, and I do not want to be in that room yet. So let's see. What other areas do we have? We have the entire second floor over on the other side of the building to check out. So we will do that first. Uh, because that room we just went to, uh, there's another boss fight there. Um, if you're watching, you probably know exactly what... Is there really another one? No! Come on. Damn it. Just not my day. I think there's going to be one or two more over here. Um, they're incredibly hard to avoid. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Ooh. This is trouble. And there's another one. I'm probably almost dead now. Oh, wait. I took... <sighs> For some reason, I was thinking I didn't heal. I'm a fucking idiot. Okay. Um, so we know that there's the ones there. Uh, they can be avoided. We've got... Two in here. Shit. Okay. Come on. Come on, motherfucker. As long as your friend doesn't come over here, we should be good. Sounds like your friend is making his way. Okay, now we can uh, <laughs> avoid that one forever because he's just going to waddle his dumb ass around. Hopefully there aren't more in here. Oh! Oh! Shit, I fucked that up! Okay, I need to take I need to take a look at my health and I need to seriously reevaluate what I'm doing here. Because oh boy. Oh boy. Oh fucking boy. And the problem is they're gonna be everywhere. Um if we can get through that one hallway where I was just getting fucked up by them, it's possible we'll be able to get uh to the area where we need to go and not have to go through there again. Um, so I probably just should have tried running for it for the amount of damage I took. And this is why I wanted to hold this part, this specific part, off for a second stream. Uh, because it's entirely possible that I might just want to die in this part here. Um, and then try everything again. Because I don't, I, it's, it's been a long time since I've done this and I don't remember where all the, uh, hmm. Excuse me, I'm having my lunch here while I'm streaming at you guys. Um, fuck was I going with that? It's entirely possible. Let's see, can I get past you? Nope. Yes. I wanted to go in the other door. I didn't even need to go up to this guy, son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah, this is why I wanted to do this in a st uh, second stream, to get all my... Dumb bullshit out of the way right away. No. Through the door. There we go. <laughs> These hunters are motherfuckers, as you can see. Oh. When they scream like that before they jump. Oh. And there we go. Okay. That's first death on stream, I think. You died. All right, so we get to go through all of that again. But now that we know... <clears throat> hmm. Shit, excuse me. Now that we know more of where they are and where they're going to be, we can uh, come up with a strategy to avoid them, uh, which is the important part. 
I'm trying not to do that boss fight. Actually, you know what? Give me half a second here. Evil Zero, Resident Evil Zero, Cult Python, Resident Evil. So I'm trying to figure out where it is. Players can obtain the python by inserting the red gem into the eye of the tiger statue. The gem is found in the place of the eye of a stuffed deer in the trophy room. Interesting. And that's the trophy room. Okay. So I just wanted to double check all of that before I went on. All right, so we need to go through all the item management again. I'll probably save more, uh, just since we're going to be <laughs> fighting a lot of progress here. Um, I don't think the... Mm, excuse me. I don't think the pistol actually uh, has the ability to stun these damn things. Um, otherwise, I would be using the pistol to deal with these guys. Because if the pistol could stun them, I could just stun them all in one hallway and just handle them. Kind of like we handle the dogs where we just wait for them to get up and shoot them, but they don't go down. Um, so they kind of they kind of have, like, pistol armor like the dogs do. All right, we're not running with our healing thing because I'm going to be picking up as many green herbs as possible. That way, when we do run into problems, we can... You know, save and reset. Let's see, there's the blue ones. We don't care about the blue ones. Let's keep on keeping on. Kind of happy we went through the trouble of uh, taking out the dogs here. Alright, we're kind of forced to watch this again. I have to I have to answer the Brad call. I'm 90% sure I have this to answer Chris. it. This is Chris! Brad, can you hear me? Damn! Hmm. <clears throat> Alright, so yeah, the reason I'm not running with healing or anything is because there were all these green herbs uh, sitting around here that we want to grab. Um, and we're never going to come through here again because we're never going to deal with that one, uh, that one uh, hunter. So I want to grab everything now. Or grab as much as I can now. Actually, we will have to deal with the hunter later, because we have to come through here to uh, finish a few more things. Um, part of the game does route us back this way. So. Let's see. As long as we can avoid getting fucking bitten. We've done good so far. Doesn't seem like I've jinxed it there, which is nice. But we're going to have to go through there two more times, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, and we should have at least one more herb to grab over here. Is this a blue one? Yeah, it is a blue one. So never mind. No. This is the red one. Right? Yeah, okay. This is useful. Been... Yes, I shall mix the herbs. At least we still get to or we get to see the cool cutscene again, right? I'm actually semi excited for that. The cutscenes, the, the like CG cutscenes in these games were really, really cool back in the day because they were it they, I mean you saw that, it just popped in immediately. There was there was a jarring transition just like that, and then bam, we're we're stuck dealing with a damn hunter. Um, so since we know we're gonna be facing it because we just died doing this, we can Immediately turn to the right and then keep moving. All right, we want it. Yes, yes, this is what we want. Perfect. I may have to use that one extra herb, which would mean that it was fucking pointless for me to actually grab it. But <laughs> you know what? Actually, that's not true. 
Because we don't need to pick up this Doom Book right now. We're actually going to have to go back in the other direction with the Doom Book. So we can just kind of duck in there, grab some ammo, and then head back out here. Shit. There we go. <laughs> that turn radius is not nearly fast enough to do something like that. Shit. Should have been patient. Come on, motherfucker. Yeah, you ain't shit. You didn't take as much damage that time. Yeah, only took four shotgun shells. That's awesome. That's freaking awesome. I'll apologize to anybody who has that uh, accent that I just butchered for butchering it. Um, I don't have any fucking space. <laughs> Hopefully you're not too offended. If you are, I shall commit Sudoku at a later point. Alright, let's drop this off. See, we've got a ton of green herbs. Which is good. It's useful. We can use it. Grab these, jam them in our box. <laughs> um, and then from there, continue on. Alright, so since I'm going to have to go to that upper hallway there... Um, in the near future here, what I'm going to do <clears throat> is I'm going to see if I can't clear it out with the pistol. Um, do a quick save here. Um, and then if we actually have problems with this, excuse me, we can just uh, save scum it later. But I want to see how these things react to the pistol. I'm pretty sure um, it's not going to go well for us. But if it does... That gives us a lot more uh, flexibility with how we approach the rest of this mansion now that it's completely repopped with enemies, you know? Um, which hopefully we'll be able to um, see some good use out of this damn pistol still. Because we basically want to come up... Why was every third shot missing it? Did y'all see that? Alright, let's see. Yeah, you're dead. Okay. Wow. Every sec every third shot misses. Look at that. And I'm almost dead. All right, who's going to win? Not fucking me. There goes my head. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay. So I guess the good news is we can take out that one down the hallway uh, with the pistol. Oh, I really hate to be, I really hate to be like a save scummy son of a bitch here, but these things do not fuck around and I want to conserve some of that shotgun ammo. Because, I mean, if y'all were here, y'all saw I was pretty much out of shotgun ammo by the time I got to the other side of the house. And I was I was avoiding a lot of those damn uh, hunters along the way. I mean, you can, you can kind of brute force it with the shotgun and just run your way through and use a ton of health items, to be honest. Um, but I don't know how I feel about doing that. Um... Jill has a much better time with these things uh, because she gets acid rounds and a bazooka. Um, and those acid rounds, it's like one or two shots. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, fucking hell yeah. I wonder if I can bait this other one out. <laughs> Think we can do this? Ah! Okay, chill there, chill there. Yes, fuck you! <laughs> this is great. Oh, this is fucking... Yes, fuck you! Yeah, you piece of shit, eat my ass! Yeah, you don't know how to stairs! <laughs> I'm actually delighted by that. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have saved. Oh. Whew, that's one less thing to worry about. Did I take any damage there? No, I did not. Cool. And we have to come through that hallway a few more times, so that actually helps us out tremendously. 
Um, wow! <laughs> I am floored by that, Shagan. Let's see, let's drop off that. Grab the mansion key again. Drop that off, and let's see what else. <laughs> Should I be an asshole and try to kill these things with a combat knife? <laughs> Let me know in the chat if you want to see me fight a, a fucking hunter with a combat knife and ruin all my progress. That'd actually be kind of funny. Honestly. All right, so this one hallway up here. Um, we took a few hits when we ran through it, and I'm wondering if we should actually take the time to clear out the hunters here. Because I know there's two. There's two hunters in the hallway up here we have to go to, um, and that becomes a problem. So we're going to go over here and use the key, uh, but we're not going to go in the room, and then we're going to go deal with the other hunter hallway. Glad they didn't put any hunters in there. You've used the mansion key. We all know what key it is. It's the damn helmet key. I should... I, I haven't checked the key, you know? Um, which is fine. Everything should be fine. Alright, let's see. Hmm. You know what? Why not? A carving of a helmet. We now have the helmet key instead of just the mansion key. See, I didn't know that uh, the first time I played through. I didn't realize the checking thing was a thing. Wow. Come on, get up, get up. Come on. Yes, if you keep getting fucked up around that corner. Okay, there's that one. We've taken some damage. And then there's another one right there. We will deal with you the next time we come through this hallway, bro. I ain't trying to fuck with you right now. Alright, so last time we tried to get through that upper hallway from the top here. I think that was a mistake. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to try the bottom hallway here. Um, we're going to need to clear that out anyways. One, to get to the item box uh, and other things that are down here. Um... Uh, but two, it might end up being the safer route overall. Because um, you have to go... You have to go through an extra screen or two to get to the item box, and obviously the area outside the item box is populated with these fucking uh, hunters. Um, but overall, uh, you never need to go up to the top floor. <laughs> Shit! Fuck this! Fuck this! Fuck! Ooh, no fucking thank you! That's a fucking rule! All right. So we're in yellow caution. Come on, walk around the corner here. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Come on, buddy. I shouldn't fuck around. Wow. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, okay. Ooh. This fucking non-auto-aim is a fucking nightmare. And apparently I could have seen the guy for a while, so let's try this again. Okay, we're gonna take care of the guys up in the upper hallway with the pistol, and then we're gonna continue on. Um, we might just try to avoid those two fuckers in the hallway there for now. Um, that shotgun really isn't doing a good job against these fucking hunters. I, I really want to get the damn... Um, the Magnum as soon as possible, which unfortunately is kind of a tremendous pain in the ass for us. Because <sighs> we have to go all the way across the mansion and through a ton of fucking hunters. Um, there's certain areas I don't need to go anymore. Um, so we should be okay. Uh... <coughs> Trying to follow the path we're taking now. There we go. That one's down. All right. Now let's take out this one with our stupid little trick again. Yeah, you ain't shit. No, the stairs. The stairs. The stairs. You fucking idiot. Ooh. Well, that didn't go as well as it 
did last time. Fuck you. I will waste all my goddamn pistol ammo on you. Combin. You know what? While we're at a point where we need to heal, let's see if we can't pistol the fucker in this room here and at least take out one of them. I really, I kind of really just want to get rid of these guys. The problem is when they get close, it turns into a serious problem. It, and I can't even aim at these fuckers. Of course I'm... Fuck! Oh! I'm gonna lose out on the damage I just did to that guy, and I'm gonna have to heal. This part's a slog, you guys. Just bear with me. We'll we'll break through this wall eventually. Uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying watching the failure. Uh, <laughs> if you are, you can tell me what a scrub I am over there in the chat. Always like hanging out in the chat. That took a fair amount of damage there. And yes, I know I have more healing items than God sitting on me over here. Um... Shagan. No, 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 no. Damn it. Having the square button as the as the the cancel button is a tremendous pain in the ass. That should hopefully be enough to let me actually heal. Yeah, that'll get me to to fine. All right, I hope I come around this fucking corner and this last guy takes one more shot. I hope the damage carries over and it doesn't reset when you leave the room. Uh, I don't know if it does or not. That would make me sad if it did. To be perfectly honest. I'm not even going to waste time on the hallway over there. I should probably just go through the trouble of, of fighting this this next boss here. Man, he was probably one pistol round away, which I managed to miss. Wow. The fucking combo. Oh. Oh, shit. Alright, so we take care of that one. We avoid that one. And then we continue on. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully I won't screw up this next room too much. But oh boy, has this become incredibly tough. Why am I going this way? I want to go down. <laughs> Get it? Go down. I'm a fucking juvenile. Oh well. <laughs> this part, this part is a serious problem. <laughs> Because especially, like, you get lulled into this false sense of security, like, oh, I have to go back to the mansion. Everything will be fine in the mansion. Oh, this game also starts a trend. Um, because in the... Uh, this is the obviously the first game in the series. And right after you run into Wesker, you start running into these goddamn hunters. Um, in, like, every other game you play... Every time you run into Wesker, you, you run into Hunters. Okay, so you're not over there yet. There we go. Come on, kill him. I probably... I wasted a terrific amount of ammo just trying to get the motherfucker there. Son of a bitch! Let's see, do we hear any more? No, but that doesn't... SHIT! That would have been an insta-kill if it had gotten me. Come on, get up, get up! I will go through every last bit of ammunition I have on these fucking things. Because you, ha you have to! They're they're incredibly difficult to avoid, and if you get a, if you get a at the 
Are there none here? No, it's right fucking there! Come on, you son of a bitch. Yes! The problem is, now I'm almost out of fucking ammo. And you know there's gonna be one right- No, 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 no! Fuck. <sighs> like, the amount of an damage they're- they're taking almost makes me want to just... Like, look at this, I have two fucking shotgun rounds left. Oh, this is poor. This is really poor. I know that I've got more ammo for these damn things somewhere. I've got to find it, though. Clip. Clip. I thought I had two clips. Ink ribbon. Ink ribbon. Nope. I guess I could bring a first aid spray. Lord knows I'm going to fucking need it. I'm not going to save here just because... Um, if I run into problems, I want to get that ammo back, uh, because I might actually try just fucking... Oh, wow, you aren't that much trouble at all. I might just try running around these guys once we get to a certain point. <clears throat> okay, so that guy's a fucking problem. Oh, shit. I don't know the pass number. It's... I'm going to get hit real hard here. Let's go. I'm, no, I want to go for this fucking door. There we go. Get me in there. Okay. Ooh, this is, uh... Wait, no. This is not my fucking game. Alright. Uh, this room's important. And there's uh, shotgun shells right there. Head of security department. X day is approaching. Complete the following orders within the week. Lure the members of STARS into the lab and have them fight with the BOW in order to obtain data of actual... <clears throat> excuse me, battles. Collect two embryos per BOW type, making sure to include all species except for Tyrant. Destroy the Arclay lab, including all researchers and lab animals in a manner which will seem accidental. Orders has been filed. More magnum rounds. And more shotgun rounds. So I'm going to have to actually come back in here. Because there's an important thing I need to do in here as well. Um, so we're actually going to leave those shotgun rounds since we're going to have to come back up here anyways. And I'm going to grab this fucking thing. Nothing important. Oh, I know what I have to do first. Nothing important. You're nothing important. There's a switch. Will you push it? Yeah. Now it seems there's something important. I wonder what this is. There we go. <clears throat> will you try and take out the eyeball? Yeah, I will. Alright, this is going to net us the thing that's going to let us deal with these hunters uh, appropriately. Uh, so we immediately want to run our asses back down to where we came from. Perfect! Uh, we're still going to take a bunch of hits dealing with these assholes, unfortunately. Let's see, are you going to run at me? No? You're not coming at me, bro? I like that. Was there another one in here? I hope there wasn't. If there was, I'm going to be sad as fuck. Alright. So this is what this is all led up to. All this dying and... Fucking wasting shotgun rounds and everything. I want to come over here. And this is completely optional. You do not have to do this, but oh boy does it kneecap you for the rest of the game. Fucking Colt Python. We're going to roll with this through the rest of this fucking mansion because I can't be bothered. Let's take a look at this fucking thing. Colt Python. Magnum rounds loaded. That's all it says. Alright, let's equip this fucking thing, and let's go take care of that god 
damn Huntard. Not the one down here. The one up top. Right, so I want to come around this way. We cleared out the stuff at the end there, so I don't even have to worry about that. Um, watch me die now that I have the Magnum here. <coughs> watch me get one-shotted by these assholes. Alright, so hopefully it won't be triggered as soon as I come around this corner. And I'll be able to get it. I think it'll take two shots. Three? Are you fucking... I went through four fucking magnum sh These goddamn assholes. Whew. I'm getting real frustrated by this, you guys. I, I'm sure you can tell. I'm sure you can absolutely tell. That guy being over there in that corner and not triggering unless you sit in front of the door for a second is probably the saving grace of that hallway. You still do need to take out the other one. But that's still better than nothing. And oh boy. It's like it's designed to just make you go through all of the health you have up to this point. And that's bad. It could be a lot worse, honestly. It could be a lot worse, actually. Um... <laughs> Is that all you got? <laughs> okay, we're making some progress. If I get to a certain point here, um, I will end up saving. So we're going to come in here, we're going to grab these shotgun rounds. Which were, where, right here? Yep. And we're going to try, we're going to try and conserve this magnum, but, um, especially if we can catch these, these, uh, hunters at range, I will not fuck around. Um... We need to go somewhere to get that key code. And I don't remember exactly where it is. Look at this guy. So let's take a look at our map and see. Alright, all that shit is locked. Let's look at the first floor. There's that hallway there, but that's locked from the other side. I'm actually going to look it up really quick. So bear with me here. Mansion key code Resident Evil. Mansion on second floor. The safe room under the staircase. There's a door that needs the code. Okay, here it is. Is it just there to tease me? Oh. Oh, okay. I see what I have to do. I'm not happy about it, but I see what I have to do. So what we're going to do is we're going to go down here and we're going to head all the way over to the other side of the fucking mansion again. Because that's where we need to go to do the thing we need to do. Goodbye. The fact that he doesn't even, the fact that he doesn't even, like, come after us anymore is kind of laughable. I really wish I had some fucking blue herbs, though. Not that way, this way. Here we go. <laughs> However, coming over here and grabbing this magnum should make the next, uh, unfortunate thing we have to do. No, 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 no. <laughs> See, some of these you can, like, run by, but you're gonna have to deal with them every time. This game is a classic. I hope y'all are enjoying. I, know I am. Okay, so from here, I want to head back up. Alright, let's keep on keeping on. 
All right, so we want to run around back to uh, where we came from and go to that one room. I know you're here. Oh, you're not. Oh, shit, are you all around over here? Where did you come? How did you even behind? Oh, he must have been, like, right at that corner where I couldn't see. He had to have been. All right, we're going to go down here and save. We need to save. <laughs> we desperately need to save. I don't remember this being this hard. Then again, it has been so long since I've actually played through this original um, game as Chris. And Chris, Chris definitely has a much harder time of it. All right, so we're going to come over here. We are going to... Oh, come on. We are going to fucking save. You can save your progress with this. Will you use the ink ribbon? Yes. Like, this is, this is the least amount of progress we've ever been able to save. It's kind of insane, if you think about it. Because all we've done is burn through a ton of, uh, a ton of healing items. Where was that? All we've done is burn through a ton of healing items and grab the magnum. I mean, yes, we've killed a few hunters, but... We still have so many of them to deal with, and it's kind of a crapshoot um, every time you deal with a hunter, whether or not you're going to take, like, if you're trying to avoid it, whether or not, actually, in any case, whether you're going to take a ton of damage or little to no damage. So, like, that, that last hallway we went through, where I haven't killed the hunters yet, we've gotten incredibly lucky with the fact that those damn things haven't hit us. Um, even if they do hit us with the little dumb ankle swipe thing. This key is useless now. Discard? Yes. Alright, so we're going to do that, and we're going to do one more thing. Um, even if it hits us in the ankle, that's still... Like, that's still a better scenario than if they, they, they did their screaming lunge attack and, and hit us, or any type of their flying air attack, because you always take a ton of damage with that. The one decapitates you, though, when they scream... Luckily, if you're moving, you shouldn't have that much of an issue dealing with that, but it's still, like, it's still rolling the dice every time. And you're just waiting to get that one good run, you know? All right, we're going to grab one more fucking first aid spray. Oh, wow, I've, uh, I've burnt through the vast majority of my items here, just getting to this point that's... Uh, Actually, incredibly uh, disconcerting. <sighs> All right, I think we can do this. I should have used the used the the key, then saved, then grabbed my stuff, then come up here. But I'm an idiot. Clearly, it sucks that you can't just try the key card, and you actually have to come over here. And fight for it. All right, here we go. Let's see. Anything useful in here right now? Nope. Just this piano. Let's see. Ah! Oh. This almost seems completely worthless. Uh-oh. God damn it, I keep fuck. All right, let's see. We're in caution. But I think I think that was it. Yeah! Yeah, fuck you, yawn. And yawn my ass. Whew. That was tense. Oh, that was really tense. 
And of course he didn't drop anything. He left that hole in the floor. A hole opens in the fireplace. They really expanded this fight uh, later in the game. Or in the remake, I mean. Will you jump down? Yes, I will. I wonder where this will lead. Some fucking fucked up hallway. Look at this. Just a random thing. Alright, there's a switch below. Will you push it? Yeah. You don't get to read the name that's on there, but you get access to another area again. So what was that? Five magnum rounds and seven, six or seven uh, shotgun rounds? There's a ladder. Will you descend it? Yes, I shall. That could have been much worse. Listen to this music. Look at this! You guys remember zombies? In this zombie game? You guys remember Zambambus? Do I have a map of this area? It's a basement. Okay. There's something over here. There's at least another zombie. And then shotgun rounds. Perfect. Because we just dumped them all out. The hope is that I don't have to use either of those... Um, excuse me. The hope is that I don't have to use either of those uh, first aid sprays. Um, I'm not holding out hope. I'm assuming I'm going to have to go through one. Listen to this music. What's that sound? Oh, I know that sound. I'm pretty sure there's something useful over here. So I'm going to walk right over here, get them to both stand up, and... Yes! Optimal! Oh. Well, there's no... Like, special thing over here, but... This is exactly what we need, because now we can go back to regular fight. Woohoo! Yay! So we've broken through a difficulty wallet. I want to check that body a few more times. Nope, 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 nothing there. Okay. Whew, what was I saying? Um, you unlocked it. We've broken through a difficulty wall at this point, fortunately. Um, we're still going to have a few more... Um, it's dusty. It has not been used for a long time. It's dusty. It has been not, not been used for a long time. Um... We've broken through a wall where we're dealing with, uh, less Zambambus. I'm gonna let you take a bite out of my foot. Even if I go to Yellow Caution, that's still... Oh, hey. No penalty whatsoever. Um. Anyways, we're not dealing with hunters at this point. Uh, we're gonna be able to refill our... Uh, ammunition stores quite a bit here, um, and this is the main. This is the main reason we came back to the mansion is to get into this hallway here. It's kind of unfortunate that I don't have the pistol with me, but considering the circumstances, I mean, there really isn't. So probably didn't need to kill half of these guys. Uh, let's take a look at our map. Because there's a specific way I want to go through these rooms here. And it'll be the... Oh, hey, look. Another herb in case we had problems. I think there's one more around this corner? Somewhere. We want to go in here because there's more of the ammunition that we require. Look at this. It's just a storeroom with shotgun shells. Isn't that sick? And a battery. Oh, we need the battery here. So the first thing we need to do, actually, is get out. Um, we're going to have to deal with hunters here in a second. Woo! Uh, wait, no. Map is what I want to look at. So you look at the map. This takes. This is going to eventually take us... Uh, 
back out to the hallway that leads down to the the saber room. Maybe I didn't need to switch to the magnum yet. Yeah, we're still dealing with uh, still dealing with regular old Zambambus at this point. And there are plenty of uh, words I can't think of to grab here. Okay. So he was eating another zombie. <laughs> wow, that was a surprising waste, actually. And I don't have any space in my inventory for the uh, other thing I need, but that's fine. It's a weird end of the hallway. Just lights on poles. The door is locked. Oh, I can't get out here yet. So this entire section was a waste. This is this is where my memory of this game is the murkiest, if you guys can't tell. Uh, just because, like, this is not where you spend the bulk of the game. You, you tend to blast through here incredibly quickly compared to the rest of the game. Uh, the rest of the game, you actually spend some time wandering around. All right. Hopefully we run into something we can use those two magnum rounds on. This room has some important stuff to it. The desk is locked. So if I wanted to, I could have gone down to the... Hey, buddy. You're dead. Scrapbook. Animal attack, woman mutilated. May 20th, around 10 p.m., a 20-year-old woman's body was found by a passerby on the left bank of Marble River in the Cider District of Raccoon City. Raccoon police assume it to be a grizzly or other animal's doing because there are teeth marks along her mutilated arms and left foot that show considerable power. Since she was wearing a hiking boot on her remaining foot, it has been determined that she was attacked in the Arclay Mountains and fell into the river. They are hurrying to identify this woman. Monsters in Arclay Mountains. Some people claim they've seen monsters in the Arclay Mountains. The monsters are supposedly about the same size as large dogs and usually run in, in a pack as wolves do. This may sound like a group of ordinary wild dogs, but these monsters are surprisingly fierce and hard to hurt. So these are the dogs that fucking got out. They say these dogs won't bother you unless you wake them, so you smart readers should stay out of the Arclay Mountains for the time being. But if you're looking for adventure, check it out. You want to try? Go get eaten by fucking monsters in the mountains. Mystery on Arclay Mountains. Mountain road blocked. Due to successive disasters in the Arclay Mountains, the city authorities have decided to block the road leading to the foothills. At the same time, Raccoon Police intend to begin the search for lost people with the help of STARS team members. They expect great difficulty because of the vast size of Arclay Mountains and the primeval forest that covers most of the area. Also, people are still reporting sightings of grotesque monsters in the mountains. So based on the way they're describing this, where do you think um, the Arclay Mountains are? Um... Because they're describing grizzlies, they're describing primeval forest. You'd almost think it was somewhere on the on the in the the northwest states. Um, it's supposed to be a Midwest town, which almost makes me believe that it would be somewhere further southeast of there, like maybe a Colorado or a Montana. But the 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 different descriptions of all the shit that's going on and the fact that they think there's grizzlies and blah 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 really kind of makes it hard to pinpoint where Raccoon City is supposed to be. I mean, they call it a Midwest town. They call it a Midwest city and yet it's surrounded by primeval forests that happen to have grizzlies in them. All right, let's oop. No, god damn it. Let's see what's back here, shall we? Probably more shit we can't pick up. <laughs> There's something going on over there. Most of them are on chemistry. Those shelves look empty. There's a switch. Will you push it? Yeah, I guess. All right, what's over here? Something has been placed here. Most of them are on chemistry. Oh, there's a... There's a, a spot on the ground that's being shown. Alright, let's see. Can I get can we get around both ways? No. Alright, I might be screwing this up. I might have to do it uh, differently here. 
Oh, never mind. I can just push it straight and then straight again. Push it there, and push it here. This is a cool little, like, regular puzzle. Alright. I wonder what's in that little spot there. Oops. Come on, Magnum Bullets. Mo disc. <laughs> so basically, I need to take my happy ass to a damn... Is that it in this room here? Yeah, I guess so. No enemies or anything. That's kind of refreshing. When's the last time we walked into a room that had no enemies in this damn game? Alright, so we've done that. We've got this thing we can push out of the way. What's back here? Nothing. I have to push it the other way. I think. Let's try it. Just clip through everything ever. <gasps> a door! Oh my god. <laughs> That's cool that there's just a door hiding behind a uh, movable shelf. See, I don't see anything in here. And there's an ink ribbon I can't grab either. I can look over the courtyard from here. It's a helicopter port. <laughs> port. If I could contact the other members from there... I can look over the courtyard. No, I've done that. I didn't even click that button. Also, what is that building in the background? Is that part of the mansion? Because if it is, this mansion is huge. All right, we've got pistol ammo here, which is probably what we honestly wanted to go through this area with. All right, all right, so we still need to find a fucking way out of here. What is that? Various books? Yeah, it's just books. All right, so let's take a look at our map here. We can... That's right, we've got to go through the basement. We've got to go through the basement, guys. I completely forgot. Because you can go through the basement and come back up to that hallway. That's where I was trying to get. So... You know, dug on it. And I think I'm in yellow caution. It's not... <sighs> the elevator! God damn. <laughs> Let's go. I feel like this one's going a little more poorly than our first stream. Then again, our first stream was like all the stuff I knew, and now I'm at the point where it's like, just give me all the fucking... God damn it, just give me the bullets, just let me kill everything. I'm so tired! So this is the room where the clown farts were. Obviously, we ain't got no clown farts. Oh, what is this? Oh, what's going on? Oh. So I think this is one of the hunters. Oh, no, this is a zombie still. Which, by the way, we're still freaking out about zombies at this point, Chris. What have you been doing with... <laughs> Also, how come the zombie can open this? <laughs> oh, yeah, because this is an extra hallway. That's right. Uh, I should not have this equipped. There we go. And I think this is broken here. The elevator doesn't seem to stop on this floor. All right. Here is where we run into those uh, hunters again. <laughs> So we're going to come out, out at this fucking thing just shooting right away. Come on, get up. Are you dead? Combin. Yep, that's... That was it. Okay, so through here is the way to the item box. <sighs> All right, so now that we've cleared out that whole area, uh, my ass is going to pretty much dump everything and run through there and grab everything. Um, I'm talking no weapons even. Because <laughs> uh, the only enemy between this item box over here and there is this hunter right there. And uh, he's not a problem. 
We are going to save before we do that, though. Because <laughs> the last thing we need is for my... Let's see, did we need any other items there? I don't think we did. We don't need the crank. We don't need ink ribbons. We've got that ink ribbon there. And do we have another ink ribbon? Nope. Just this one. But we'll be picking up more. So let's... Save here. I think this is the first time we've saved in this room. We've always ended up saving either in the guardhouse or over on the other side of the mansion. <laughs> they repop the area with tyrants the moment I'm not equipped with weaponry. <laughs> that'd be that'd be fucking terrible. Uh, let's put you down there. Okay, we're going to put you down, boy. Wow, you're not really good at your job, Mr. Hunter. You're kind of an idiot. All right, let's head back over to this. Was it this way? It was this way. Yep. And we've cleared out the hunters along the way. So yeah, we can grab everything pretty much unimpeded, go back to that room, and then carry on. <laughs> Which is important. I'm going to want to grab those uh, green and blue herbs along the way, and I'm going to want to combine them with everything. We're also going to grab that small key so that we can grab some stuff. Do you see he stopped his animation for the scene transition? That was goofy. All right, so let's grab that. Scratch my nose. I will take the small key. Oh, and we're actually at a point where we can use uh, one of those. Uh, herbs as well. <sighs> Luckily, there's a ton of them, eh? Don't you know? Uh, the battery is the important thing we need to grab there, because once we have the battery, we uh, basically have our way back to the... Um, uh, back to the guardhouse we need to deal with. Let's see. So I'm pretty sure we cleared out this room, but we're going to double check. No, this was the battery room. Once again, wrong. Wrong as fuck battery. Now I can move the elevator in the courtyard. Oh, look, they even tell you. How nice of that. Yeah, I guess it's important that they do mention that to you because you have absolutely no incentive to check out the place where you need to put the battery um, until much later. So them throwing it in like that is actually pretty nice. Um, pretty useful. Alright, we're going to use this green herb. There we go. You know, it's actually kind of refreshing to take a bunch of hits from Hunters there. Hunters are always where the difficulty is in uh, both this game and Remake. When you start dealing with Hunters, you start dealing with some big fucking problems. Yes, I will use the small key. Come on, Magnum. Yeah! Fan-fucking-tastic. Magnum rounds are like, incredibly important for the end of the game. <sighs> Alright, so we still have four slots available for Chris. Will you take the ink ribbon? Yes. And we're gonna grab the pistol rounds, even though we probably definitely don't need them ever again. Uh, because I'm pretty sure... Nope, nope, I'm wrong. There are still more zombies we're gonna have to deal with. And so I want that pistol... Grabbed everything there. Let's check out this back room here. There's more stuff we needed to grab back here, definitely. Definitely. Alright, it was over here. There was, what was it, pistol rounds again? Or more magnum rounds? The, the disc. Ooh. And now I don't have, most of them are on chemistry. Okay, good. I've kind of kneecapped myself once again because um, I, now don't, I now don't have the inventory space to grab all of those herbs that I wanted to grab. Uh, so once again, shit. Uh, that MO disc is incredibly important though. So we may have to run through here one more time before we're finally done. 
Because now, since this area is safety, um, we can just, you know, grab stuff now. All right, so there were those. And then, other than that, this hallway had nothing else. So we'll grab the blue one for now. <laughs> we'll come back for those green ones. And then from there, we are going to probably take a quick two-minute break. Let's keep going. I'm having fun. I'm still. I'm the fact that I'm still having fun with this game now, this far in the future here, is amazing. Back up where we came. Drop this stuff off, and then keep on keeping on. So that's really the main reason that you come back here, is just to get those fucking... words I can't think of. Uh, just to get the, the battery and that metal uh, that we're going to have to grab on the way back. I thought I heard a zombie. I got genuinely confused. I was like, those things still exist? I might be wrong, and you guys can correct me in the chat if I am, but I was under the impression that hunters kill everything. So I was under the impression that hunters actually will kill zombies and stuff, too. If I'm wrong, that's totally fine, but I don't think I am. All right, and since we are just grabbing herbs at this point, uh, we're going to drop this off. Actually, I don't like that at all. Put you there. Where is Clip? There is Clip. Do a quick combin. Combin. So we've got 10 magnum rounds. Hopefully we have to use zero of them on the way back. Um, over to the battery area, but I'm pretty sure we're going to run into... Should I just say fuck it? I think I might just want to say fuck it. Grab it. First aid spray. First aid spray, and we want that battery. Where did I put you, battery? Battery. <laughs> All right, executive decision. Um, we're not going to go back and get those herbs, even though they might end up proving to be incredibly useful. The fact that I have the blue one, the blue one was the important one, because we're going to have to go through that area one more time. So basically what we have to do now is we have to go all the way through the courtyard again, uh, jam that battery in the one hole, um, ride that thing to the top, and then use the crank to stop the water flow to go back down. Along the way, we need to stop in that room and grab the, uh, the, the eagle metal that we didn't grab this time. Luckily, it's along the way, so we don't have the problem, <laughs> or we will not have a problem, uh, except for that one, uh, hunter that's in the room. Um, and then we can just keep running through and hopefully hopefully we can run the gauntlet of this fucking area and just take enough damage to use that first aid spray and then continue on that's my hope uh but for right now uh i'm gonna take a very short break uh thanks for everybody who's been hanging out uh hopefully you will uh bear with me while i take a short break and i will see you soon
All right. Hey, everybody. I'm back. Thanks for bearing with me. Whew! I'm half dead today. Eh, actually, it's not that bad. All right. I think we've grabbed everything we need to grab. Now it's time for us to make our journey across this fucking mansion. We should be good. Um, so if you're just joining us, uh, we just got back from a break. We have finished uh, the mansion completely. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, and at this point, we're heading back to the uh, courtyard to get to the lab. Um, and the lab is the lab is serious business. Uh, the lab, obviously, it's the end of the game, uh, but it's where everything uh, everything ties up. Um, all your decisions and all the way you ran through the game up to that point end up being... Uh, you end up see seeing the consequences of the way you played through the game, basically. Um, which in our case is good, uh, because we did everything we needed to do. Hmm, excuse me. Uh, yeah. Uh, but we're also going to run into some fucking enemies. Because uh, you start off with... This hallway's going to suck. Uh, you start off with the damn uh, zombies again. Then you work your way up to hunters, and then you end up dealing with something in, uh, that is unique to this game called... Nope, nope, bad. <laughs> you end up dealing with Chimera as well, and those things are fucking crazy. Uh, how much damage did I take? I took no damage. Good. <laughs> um, Chimera are motherfuckers. <laughs> I should probably save before I go on any further. Hmm. Yep, yep. We need to play stream safe, not shitting around at home. Oh, I lost 45 minutes of progress. Whatever, no big deal, safe. All right, so where are you? There is one of my ink ribbons. I still have more, right? <coughs> Yep, okay, I did grab the ink ribbons from the other thing. But luckily, since there's only one here, we can just burn through it and continue on. Let's see, does this show how many times I've saved here? Yep, so this will be my tenth save. Which is funny, because like six of them have come from this stream. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Six of them have come from this stream just dealing with these fucking hunters. Uh, because, oh boy have, uh, they caused us a lot of trouble here. <laughs> no, we want to go through the door. There we go. All right, we're probably going to take one more hit from that bitch uh, as we try to get around to the dam. Pick it up. Pick it up. Can I really not pick it up without turning on the light? There's a switch. Will you push it? Yeah. There's a switch. Will you push it? No. All right. And this is the last thing we need to grab in here, which is the Doom Book. Uh, the last time we went through this one, we died. We already checked this and did the whole thing. So I'm not even going to talk about it. I'm just going to pop it open. And there is a medal in the book. Woohoo. We've now got a medal. All right, what's our health at? Yeah, if we can get... If we can get to the lab entrance. Haha, -ha, you suck ass. If we can get to the lab entrance, only having to use that first aid spray I have equipped, that will be good. Are there are hunters here. Yes, there are. Good news is it's just you, and we can get around you. The fact that it's an instant transition when you hit the door is is really good for us. Let's see. No items in here. All right, so here's where shit's bad. Maybe. Maybe not. For some reason, I remembered there being hunters out here as well. Uh, if that's not the case, I'm going to be one happy boy. A winch for the elevator. The elevator is down. So we have to run through here, um, jam the battery in that spot, uh, take the elevator up here, use the crank, Go back down that elevator and go into the entrance for the lab. 
hopefully I didn't fuck up. Uh, it's entirely possible I did fuck up, but hopefully I didn't fuck up. And I'm not missing... Wait a minute, that's right. We go through the caves first. That's the entrance to the caves, not the lab. Oh, shit. We've still got a hell of a lot of game ahead of us, you guys. Woohoo! Woohoo! That sounded disingenuous. Not hearing movement. So here's how we do it. Come over here, jam the battery in, take this up. The caves are a fuck. The caves are a slog. Um, we might switch back over to the shotgun for the caves. Uh, because there's a lot of enemies that are more conducive to being killed with the shotgun. Or those spiders, actually, which is why I went through the trouble of grabbing those uh, healing herbs. I should grab those. Uh, but I'm pretty sure we end up running into an item box as soon as we get through, so... Um, as long as they stay on the ceilings or the walls, we can probably avoid them. If they get to us on the ground, that's where we're going to run into issues here. All right, I really wish that now that we're doing this, that wouldn't have to deal with the, uh, the crank anymore. But unfortunately, the crank stays in our inventory forever. Uh, all right, and now it's saying that I'm offline. Great. Let's see. Now it's still showing me live. So it's just an issue with Twitch again. How nice. I love it when Twitch gives us fucking problems. Don't you? It's still showing me as offline, but I'm still alive. There it is. Okay, good. Yesterday we had a serious problem because I actually went offline. Like I actually lost, or my connection got interrupted to Twitch. And so I ended up having to jam a bunch of recordings together. There's a ladder. Will you descend it? Yes, I shall. Um, where was I going with that? We ended up having to go through a ton of trouble to get our stream put together the way it needed to be, uh, which was incredibly unfortunate. Uh, now I don't know what I'm doing. Broken flamethrower. Oh, shit. Oh, this, this place. There's some... Kind of funny, dumb insta-kill shit in here. Oh, look, a save point. Another place for the crank? No, it's a different crank. Hexagonal hole. And this crank, if we check, I think is square. The end is square-shaped. The hole has opened, and I can't jump over it. Why not, Chris? I've seen you do some crazy acrobatic jumps and... Flying through the air bullshit in 5 and 6. Why can't you do it here? Idiot. <laughs> Alright, so this is actually where I'm going. I hear a baby crying. It's my neighbor's baby. Oh, this spot. God, it is... It's a power generator, but it does not seem to work. It's a power generator, but it does not seem to work. It's a power generator, but no, I get it. There's a first aid spray and shotgun shells here. Let's see. We're going to grab the shotgun shells. We can come back for the first aid spray. Um, and I think we will switch over to the shotgun here. Go through this door. This might have been the door we came through. Um, I'm looking for either an item box or a... Did we just go in a big loop? I think we did. Yeah, we went through a loop. And we missed another door over this way. Um, you know what? Let's examine that thing. What is this? Can't carry any more items. So that isn't the broken flamethrower. That's just straight up a flamethrower. Um, which is going to be good for us at some point here. Because I'm sure we're going to run into something that is uh, 
very weak to fire. Hopefully it's not right here, because I don't remember where the fuck it is. Jeez, those babies are really going at it. Whatever. No Enrico! Big. Enrico! Don't come any closer, Chris. Wait, what happened? Double crosser! I'm not a double- don't. Oh, he got fucking shot! By somebody. So he knows there's a double crosser and we've Is read the damn... There? The note that's like, there's a double crosser. Do you hear the person run off? Oh shit. Double crosser? What did he mean by that? <laughs> you're, you're a fucking idiot, Chris. You got any items on me? He couldn't have moved because of this injury. He's holding something. Pistol ammo that we don't fucking need. Is that all you've got? I think that's all he's got. He's holding something. Hopefully he's not holding anything other than the pistol ammo. Um. Shit! You know what? We don't need to come... Oh, there's the crank we need. Oh, shit. So we're going to have to deal with that at some point. Crap. And now there's just these fucking things everywhere. Come on, be dead. Yes! Come on, you son of a bitch. Perfect. Well, kind of perfect. That, uh... Actually, that kind of fucking sucked. That we took that much damage there. Okay. We need to go back to the... Actually, now we can grab that hexagonal crank, and that'll get us, uh, I think, to an item box. I hope to... I know there's one down here, and we fucking need it. No, give me the item. Give me the item. Give it to me! No, Why? Why does it have to be this way? The guy who shot Enrico was Wesker. Every time we run into Wesker, it's like he gives birth to these fucking asshole hunters. Are you fucking kidding me? And there goes all my fucking ammo! Oh my god! We're going to reload our fucking save. We're going to reload our fucking save here. Because holy shit, what a nightmare. What's up, King Thunder? Oh, these fucking asshole hunters. And the only problem with the hunters is that they're fucking at knee height. And I just hit fucking new... Because I'm fucking frustrated. Let's try this again. You came in on a hell of a shit show of a stream, dude. We are having just all the fucking problems. So I saved. I need to grab everything and run through fucking everything again. Like, it's almost to the point... I'm gonna have to make more stops at more fucking item boxes because Chris only has six fucking slots in his whole fucking asshole. Frustrating. Good luck, my ass. You can suck my dick. If I had an ink ribbon, I could save my progress. So fuck it. I'm done wasting. Where's shells? Give me fucking shells. I know there's shells somewhere in my fucking shitty, stupid inventory. Where's the shells? There's the shells. I think that's all the shells. That is all the shells. We're not going to need this until we get down into the area. So maybe this is going to be a massive mistake that I'm making here. You came in on the best of fuck-throughs. You came in... Oof. I am having our problems. <laughs> okay, we missed getting slapped by that guy that time. 
This part really is an incredible amount of trouble. There's a switch. Will you push it? Yes. Shit! I'm a fuck. Mm, I needed to grab a thing. Woo! Fuck you, you fucking stupid hunter bitch. I hate you, I'll kill you. Who turned off the light? Who gives a shit about power? This whole place is gonna explode. We needed to grab this thing. God damn it. Give me a second. Ugh. Yes, I will take the Doom Book Juan. I don't care about... Anything beyond this point. Yeah, you fucking suck at your job, asshole. See if your buddy in here will do the thing. Bandai Namco's conference is tomorrow? I didn't know that. Suck dicks! We're gonna hear a bunch of stuff. We're probably gonna hear more about Code Vein, too. Which, um. I'm honestly genuinely excited about. Code Vein is gonna be pretty cool, I think. Yeah, it's way over the top anime souls, but it's still souls. I want to get rid of that fucking square crank as soon as I'm done with this shit. What was your favorite thing from E3 so far, Thunder? Oh, shit. Mine was, uh... Shadow. Uh, Shadow Remastered. Because of course it fucking was. <laughs> if anybody disagrees with me, they can eat my ass. Fucking remastered Shadow of the Colossus! <clears throat> well, you go, you've already seen Code Vein. You've already seen what it's gonna look like. It's an anime Souls game. With crazy edgelord characters and vampire shit. <laughs> <clears throat> Which, I mean... That's pretty good! All right, so yeah. Those fucking babies in the other room are still going off. Hmm. Um. Uh, Sony and Microsoft's conferences were actually pretty damn good. Uh, Nintendo announced a bunch of shit that. Um, Nintendo announced a bunch of shit that. Um, uh, its fans are going crazy about, including two new fucking Metroid games. Uh, Metroid Prime 4 and a remake of Samus Returns for the 3DS. Because, of course, they're still making shit for 3DS. Um, Nintendo, or uh, Microsoft ab announced a bunch of pretty neat stuff, including uh, Xbox original backwards compatibility. Um... Code Vein was shown at uh, Microsoft's conference. Uh, the uh, the Dragon Ball Z fighting game uh, that's made by the guys who did Guilty Gear was announced at Microsoft as well. Uh, other than that, a bunch of like Western, like open world, go do shit with friends stuff was announced. Uh, so we don't need to go over that way yet. Wait, that is the way we need to go, because we don't have the fucking thing yet. Okay, so we want to get over to Enrico immediately. As soon as we get over to Enrico, we want to get the fuck out of this side of the hallway. Um, The flamethrower might be incredibly important for us later, but we can't even deal with it now. Uh, so I'm not concerned. Um, whew. And while I'm here, I want to grab those shotgun shells. Uh, there's shotgun shells in the first aid spray over here, so we'll actually we'll grab the shotgun shells, since that won't take up a slot. And then we'll grab the first aid spray. And then from there, we'll go watch Enrico die. I think you may have missed the fuckiest part of the fuck through, so... <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I'm sure we're still going to have problems here. 
All right, we've seen this. I want to skip Enrico. it, but I can't. Don't come any closer, you missed Chris. my theory that Wesker gives birth to hunters. Double crosser. Like out of his vagina. Don't. Yeah, that's what you get for trying to shoot Chris, Mister. Fourteen years old, major in the Air Force, Who is it? Redfield. Is someone there? Chris, you're a tremendous idiot. Double crosser. What did he mean by that? All right. So all he has, as far as I remember, is a pistol magazine. I don't care about that. I got caught up on a thing. I want to grab this. No, let me grab it! Yes! Okay. So we want to grab that and we want to get the fuck out. Okay, and now there's going to be more hunters we have to deal with in this room. But hopefully we can make it through without... No. Alright. Hopefully there aren't more hunters here. Oh, of course there are fucking hunters here. Alright, I can avoid you. Yeah, you ain't shit, bitch. Hopefully there's not more hunters here. I don't want to waste ammo on these guys here. Uh, because holy shit, like, it is not worth it. You're in and out of this area. Um, no, I want to use the new one. Here we go. Oh, back pain. All right, if I remember correctly, we want to use it one more time. Or wait, no, that's the different game. We need to get to an item box to drop off, drop off that first crank and that, that metal. Let's see what happens if we use it one more time. We've got time to kill. Because I'm hoping I can just rotate it 90 degrees here and there be a, a item over here. If not, it's going to rotate it 180 degrees. Yeah, it's going to rotate 180 degrees, so I'll have to do this one more time, and then we'll continue on. Could be worse. Could be. All right, one more time. Since I keep getting this one confused with the remake, where it had these extra little puzzles and everything, which was really cool for the remake to have all of that stuff. Shake the screen as much as humanly possible. <sighs> Alright, let's continue on. We need to get to an item box because at this point we don't have fucking space to pick up anything else. Including this uh, flamethrower that we need for a puzzle here. So come on. I know there's an item box down here. Oh, God! Oh, what is this? Oh, Indiana fucking Jones! Ha ha ha! Woo! Yeah, baby! We did it. We did best. <laughs> now there's suddenly music playing. Oh, my God. Uh oh. Really? And here's an item I can't grab. <laughs> That's actually incredibly important. I'm gonna wait for this fucking hunter. Come on, asshole. Sorry if y'all can hear my damn uh, gardeners again. They come out at real weird hours. Yeah, you ain't shit. <laughs> come on, keep doing that. Yeah. 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 You don't know how to deal with corners. Ha ha! Suck my ass! Of course, I don't have enough to do the thing I need to do there, don't you know? But, uh, that's okay. Item box, item box. Come on, item box! Watch this be the boss. It's a boss! Shit! I don't think I need to fight this, actually. Um, I should be able to just come in here and grab... ...items. But here we are without any fucking shit. Because uh, we need to get through there. Ow. 
And I'm dead! Son of a bitch! Shit! Chris. Oh, oh, God damn it! Oh. Oh, King Thunder, bro. Oh, my God. Oh. You know what? I'm actually going to have to cut this short. And it's not because I'm. It's partially because I'm salty. But I actually have shit to do. Um, I'm going to take care of it. I'm going to come back with a different stream that hopefully won't be as shitty as this. Because holy shit. All right. So thanks to everybody who came out. Uh, follow our follow our channel here. Follow our YouTube, which you can find in the links below. Uh, follow us on Twitter. I will catch you actually shortly. Look at my big mouse. Ah! Tell you what, Thunder. What do you want? <laughs> what was I going to tell you? I was going to tell you something. What, did you did you want me to tell you what's coming up next? Was that it? Here, ask me in the chat. I'll stay in the chat. Peace.